Hello, brothers and sisters, and welcome back to Phasmophobia. Now, uh, I've done a little research on this game about some of the things I've been doing wrong, and um, uh, as it turns out, um, cold temperatures may show up as... Um, you could probably see foggy breath with cold temperatures as opposed to freezing temperatures. Well, this was just one site I read. I've been trying to figure out how to um, uh, how to make my hunts better and how to make the video more interesting. But most importantly, try to get the right goddamn ghost. And I've learned um, a few things about a few things and about uh, um, like uh, like if I try to do the EVP, it's got to be completely dark and dark in the house. You can't have any lights on. Um, you have to ask in your own voice, which I did. I used the push a talk to do that. Um, I don't know why I'm having a hard time with EVP, but uh, we are going to dive back into this tonight and see what we can do. Now I've had a um, little bit of luck with Tanglewood Drive. And not much luck with Edgefield Road or Ridgeview Road, or Ridgeview Court. Um, so I think my focus for this video is going to be going back to these two locations and see if we can get something to happen. So I'm going to jump to this one first do our loadout. I think I've got a little bit of a better understanding on how... This whole thing works. Um, it says I've got two thermometers here and I don't need to. I think uh, that'll do that. Um, $14. <clears throat> Not going to be able to buy anything, but I've got a book. I don't have the DOTS projector, although I probably should add it. You're better off having it, not needing it, than needing it and not having it. Um, I eventually want to buy the strong flashlight because uh, I still haven't found out one way or the other if that does better than the regular one. It is twenty or thirty dollars more, twenty dollars more. Um, let's see, glow stick, head mount to camera light, or motion sensor, parabolic I don't think I need any of these as of yet, but these are in our loadouts. Tripod, it's showing I got five of them. So, I don't know. We're just going to jump right into this because uh, we need to catch ourselves a ghost. Um, I've been curious about um, being in the house versus not being in the house. And it's like for orb, for orbs. Um, if you're going to be looking for orbs, you're better off not being in the house. I guess they show up on camera better. And if you're in the house, it's going to be very tough to see it unless you're physically holding the camera. Right. Depending on the object. All right. Now, this ghost's name is Ruth Anderson. Responds to people who are alone. Good thing I am. Average sanity below 25%. <clears throat> Have a member of your team witness a ghost event. And get a ghost to walk through salt. I don't have any salt. But what I do have is I have me a flashlight. I have me an EMF detector. And I have me a... Uh, let's bring spirit box. Grab our key. Open the door. Nothing doing yet. Let's find out what it is we are dealing with. All right.
Now, the thing is, I'm going to guess that any presence of activity will read something on the EMF. Something. Whether it just be a dot or two. At least, that's my idea. But I'll said there is a cursed object in here, so... I want to keep an eye out for any bones we can find, any cursed objects we can find, and make sure we snap pictures and or collect uh, those. Oh, that's a bone. Is that a bone? No, it's a dish towel. Or a hand towel. Never mind. Hmm. That's just a back door. Does this actually go somewhere? What's oh, a back door? Okay. It's funny. Every uh, every house in this game, their kitchen table looks like the place has been set for dinner, and there's just nobody here. So far, I'm not getting a hit on anything. So, I'm gonna guess upstairs. It's funny, it's almost like it's too quiet. I'm not getting anything. It's like the previous. Did I do that? Something. I've been in this house a hot minute. I've been in this house a hot minute, and uh, I haven't. Oh, look at that! got a bone. I believe it's ten bucks. Provided I live. I have no spikes. That's my fan outside. Oh, oh, we got EMF of five. Okay, we got EMF of five. Hello, is there anybody here? What's your name? How did you die? Everything just seemed to have stopped.
Hello, is that you? I'm getting nothing on the spirit box. Okay. So I'm going to head out to the truck, put that in my uh, thing, and grab a new... Uh... Yeah, barely much of anything on there. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and put this back. Where is it? Come on. Oh, that's right. It's F. Okay. So, I haven't done any of that. How's my sanity? 82? Damn. Okay, so journal. We definitely have EMF of 5. So that narrows our list down by... <sighs> Still a lot. I think that's 10. So... Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and grab, I'm going to grab the book. Um, I'm going to put back the spirit box too, just because I don't think it's doing much for me. I'm going to grab the video camera though. Yeah, I'll grab the video camera. And I'm going to go upstairs. That room was a hot spot twice in a row. See, the thing is, I don't know if it was the room or the bathroom. The bathroom door was wide open, and I thought maybe I heard it open. I'm going to set the book right here. See what happens there. And can I I'm trying to figure out how I can get this camera? So a tripod would be cool. I'm just gonna put it right here. I don't know if it's gonna work right here. Put the camera right there. No, you're looking flush at the wall. That ain't gonna help. Why, why do I have a candle? Drop the candle. Closet door is open. That's what that door was. book there. Can't I set the camera like right next to the book? I don't know if that's going to help. That's not in a good spot. If I... Can I put it right there? Eh, let's see what that does. So I'm going to leave the house. I'm going to go check out the... Uh, camera in the truck. See what kind of evidence we can get. Alright, mouse. Where's my crosshairs? Right there. Yeah, that's not a good shot. I don't even know what I'm looking at. It looked like it was looking at kind of a wall. But the activity it's spiking right now. I 
I'm looking at the wall in here. I never turned on night vision. That's right. I'm gonna go back up and turn on night vision. See if we got anything in our book. Where did I put the book down? Oh, it was right next to it. Nothing in the book. All right. Let's see if that's better. It's right there. There we go, we got night vision now. It's not the greatest. I also found out that when you're using the uh, the UV light, which is probably what I'm going to go in with next. Um, did I just see an orb? It uses my imagination. Um, when you go in with the UV light, it's best to check doors, just basically just doors and... Um, light switches. Uh, you're probably not going to see anything else much anywhere, if at all, from what I was reading. I said it's not a good view. I, could, I couldn't get a good view. Maybe I should go in with a tripod and, give, and just do that. Go with a tripod and UV light and try that. Tripod, UV light. Is it doing anything right now? Nope. So I don't like capturing something against the wall. I want to set this up like right here. Oh, I didn't do that. That wasn't me. How do I put this down? Oh, I just drop it. All right, we'll pick this up. There we go. Haven't gotten writing yet. But at least it should be a better picture. I still gotta look for that cursed object. Oh, there was a big spike when I was in there. Alright. Oh, that's a good shot. If we're going to get an orb, this is how we do it. This is exactly how we do it. <laughs> and it's, it's not really fun watching someone watch, is it? Is anything stirring up in there? Nothing's happening. So it's better with two people because you can have someone in the room doing something else while someone else is just in the truck watching. Because if you're in there by yourself, you're going to spark something up. That's why playing this game by yourself, it's creepier, but it's a little tougher too. Okay, I'm going to go a step further. It's a lot tougher. Um, I 
thing is I'm waiting for someone to tell me that I don't wait long enough for things to happen. Maybe it's just my impatience. I don't see any orbs. I don't see any orb. So I'm curious, if I pull out the book, actually, you know what? I'm going to do it like this. Just so I can at least keep that on my screen a little bit. Even though I think it, oh no, that thing's still moving. Okay. If I get rid of orb and get rid of spirit box, I never went in with a temperature gauge, did I? No, I didn't. Right. I got these things and I never grabbed them. So we're going to go back in again. Yeah, there was a bit of a spike there and there was no orb. Okay, no writing. Area is like 50, 51. Drop right to 36. Whoa. Okay. That was singing. That was creepy as fuck. That was creepy as fuck. That was singing, though. Okay, this I'm going to go ahead and put back. Singing. That was like humming. Who sings? Down goes a very powerful path to defend their place to death or sing. Killing anyone that's overseeing their weapon. The spirit can be temporarily stopped by burning smudge sticks near them. Wasn't it? Miling? Miling, miling. Very vocal and active ghosts. They are rumored to be quiet when hunting their prey. A miling is known to be quieter when hunting. Milings are more frequently make paranormal sounds. Okay, I'm leaning towards that one. Raiju. Demon that thrives on electrical current. While generally calm, they, they can become agitated when overwhelmed with power. Constantly disrupting electronic equipment. I don't think so. I don't think so. I didn't I didn't do that. I did, but I didn't. A wraith. One of the most dangerous ghosts you find, also only known ghosts of ability of flight, and has sometimes been known to travel through walls. Okay, Obak. Where's the Obak, Obak, Obak? Okay. Terrifying shapeshifters capable of taking many forms. They have been seen ta taking on humanoid shapes to attract their prey. Ghost will shape shift. Okay, that's all about shape shifting. It's this was singing. I don't remember the jinn being able to 
the travel, their speed, not the gin, the shade. Very shy. No, it's not it. Oni. Scare their victims as much as possible. Most people are nearby and will drain their sanity faster when manifesting. How is my sanity? Eh. I don't think it's an Oni. Gorio. Gorio. Passes through a DO test so the video camera will see it. But it will usually show itself by camera with no people nearby. They're rarely seen far from their place of death. And the twins, I don't think the twins had anything to do with sound. They mimic each other's actions, alternate their, their, their attacks to confuse their prey. Either twin can be angry and initiate attack on their prey. The twins will often interact with the environment at the same time. I've got to go with the myling on this one. Very vocal. That was singing. Okay. I'm going to go with that, even though I've got nothing else to back it up other than how it's acting. So, do I have anything in my inventory? Yeah, I'm going to put this back. Where was this? Was this right here? Alright, is it hunting? Nah. Go up, get my equipment. Where's my book? Can I not pick up the tripod? Oh, there's my book. I threw my book on the floor. Man, activity's picking up right now. Alright, well I never got anything on the book. go back in for the tripod if it'll let me pick it up Okay, I guess I can't pick up my tripod. It won't let me pick up the tripod. So that's on, and it's not doing anything. It didn't say anything about electronics, though, did it, with the myling? We're going to, uh, we've got all of our equipment, save for the uh, tripod, which makes it easier, but I don't know how you're supposed to pick it up. I don't know. we got one event off our list. Yeah, 
so we're just gonna call this hunt the day. And when that thing started singing, there was now when I heard the breath, you know, that made all the hair stand up on my neck when I heard that. Welcome back. Like a Gorio? How? Welcome back. Gorio. I never never got around checking for fingerprints. But even if it had fingerprints, I still would have guessed the miling because fingerprints is that too. There was no ghost writing though. Maybe that should have been my hint. It just basically threw my book on the floor. That's frustrating. That's very frustrating. So, okay. God, that bugs me. I haven't really taken a peek at, around this place. I don't even know what's here. Oh, you see, there's salt right there. Why can't I just take them out of the case there? Do I have enough money to get a flash? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. Well, we're going to go to this location now. This location? This location. All right, shop. Nope, not yet. They're, I only got $34. Man, these hunts, they're not paying very well. It's like that one I would have had to have set up the DOTS projector. And gotten it on camera that way. Which I can do. Okay. God. All right, we're going into this one. Ours is not to question why, is it? God, that really bugs me, though. I mean, it was like, that was singing. That was straight up singing. You know, it's like all of, that, all of them that has actually has a five on the... Uh, I never found the cursed object either. Uh, I know in the journal, I know there's a uh, a thing on cursed possessions. A mirror, a Ouija board, a voodoo doll, summoning circle, music box. Was that thing on the floor the music box? I was reading on it, they're hard and easily missed. I felt last one it was it was right. I felt like it was right. But I felt that way about all of them so far. So what in the hell of it does I do I know does I know? We're going with one of these this time. So flashlight on. Get the key. Let's start this. Turn on until I get in the house, right? Do the do it like I do every investigation. I'm gonna do a sweep of the downstairs first, and I got the key. Did 
Did I pick up? I got the key. Strange. I picked up the key. Like, oh, okay, that was weird. It's that sound when you first walk into one of these houses that. sounds. Not a fan of that. Not at all. Okay. I heard that. Which door was that? Is that the closet door? Oh, this is a laundry room. Getting a 2.0. This thing is not too shy. It's starting almost right away. like this room. Why do you like this room? And there you go. Temperature's dropping. Oh, going back up again. Pretty much like that investigation in the last episode. It seems to be centered right around this area. Hmm. So, I think I want to come in with the camera again, put it right on that table. Have it look right down in that hallway. It's doing almost nothing right now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put this back. Grab the camera. Pop on night vision. Although these lights kind of fire blind me. I'm just going to right there in the middle of the table. Is that gonna be a good? Uh... I don't know if that's gonna be looking right down the wall. If I'm gonna get the same view I had before, that wasn't really where I put it last time. isn't exactly horrible. Our EMF was only two, so there's nothing really amazing about that. Is that counting down to a hunt? I never understood what that clock was for.
Now the clock's at zero. Yeah, I'm not sure what the point of the clock is either. Don't like that that back of that chair is right uh, right there the way it is. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to go in with EVP. I'm never going to have to work. Hello, is there anyone here with me today? What's your name? That's freezing temperatures. We have got freezing temperatures, my dudes. How did you die? spirit box but we definitely got freezing temperatures it says right there when doors are opening and closing it's like it's good at moving doors but we got freezing temperatures so I'm gonna go ahead and write that down again I'm going to back it up like this so I can at least um got nothing on the spirit box haven't seen a ghost orb yet EMF has only gone up to a two Had zero luck with the spirit box. I might grow in, go in and drop that. Uh, this thing, the uh, DOTS, on the ground. put on the floor or if that work right there on the table I might have to put it on the, on the floor but I don't recall ever using that before um, back in the day when this first came out. I don't, I'm not sure if it was part of it or not. Man, 
I feel like I feel like there's something else I should be doing. I'm gonna go in with the UV. See if I can get a fingerprint or something. Oh, turns light on, huh? music I feel like I want a camera. I have a feeling I'm gonna need to take a picture of a ghost. But, you know, I'm gonna grab this. Else do I? Oh, I don't need that. I'm not, I'm not going to use this anymore. Let's grab the camera. Go with the camera first. I don't know why I felt like I needed a snap picture there. I just felt like it. physically be in there. I'm just going to hang out there for a little bit. Anything in the book yet? bathroom light there is flickering a little bit. It likes that bathroom. Something just moved. Something else is moving. Come on, you ghost, do something.
prove to me that you're here. I mean, I only got two snaps left. I'm going to guess no hits with the book. Sanity's at. What if these things just don't really like me? So I'm going to say nope on the book. Uh, keep the camera. I'm going to go and pick up the DOTS projector. I don't think that's yielding anything. Bring that back out to the truck. The only thing I have left in there is my camera. of technology, get it back to the truck. Slap that back there. Flop. So I'm going to go back in with the EVP. I've got nothing to go on. That's what's sad about this. I'll grab this as well, just in case I'm just not using... Oh, what else do I... Oh, I don't need that. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna put that back. What was that? No, that was down there. Why won't it? There we go. And then I'll grab that. Is it? Is it? Oh. Is that even doing anything? Such an anticlimactic hunt. Ghost hunt, I mean. So he threw a cup around. Spirit box, I think, is a bust. I'm, I'm just not. 
It's just making noise. So, I'm gonna play a game of what do I know, even though it isn't much. There was no ghostwriting. I didn't see any fingerprints. I didn't see any ghost orbs. Got nothing on the spirit box. Oni. Except there could be an EMF of five. But every time I went in there, it was it was two at best. And I know there was one that was the last 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 episode of the episode before last. It was I believe there was there was one case where it was like I only got two, but it's like oh there was an EMF level five for that one. Like, where DOTS didn't really produce anything, but I'm not sure certain I used it right. Like I said, I never really used it before. So. Let's be wrong, again, because I don't really know what else to do. So, uh, we're going with Oni. Got all my equipment. And, uh, did I ever turn that off? I never turned that off, did I? Nope. And, um... We're peacing out, because I really don't know what else to do. So. I completed none of my extra tasks. It's like coming up dry. Welcome back. Like Who's a Moroi? I got nothing. I got nothing that time. I got nothing but I did nothing but waste my own time. So I'm gonna leave. Moni, Moni, Moroi. Moi have risen from the green to drain energy from the living. I wasn't really doing much. They have been known to place curses on their victims, curable only by antidotes or moving very far away. The weaker their victims, the stronger the Morai becomes. Morai suffer, suffer from hyper, hyperosmia, weakening them for longer periods. That's the thing. It's supposed to be spirit box. I got nothing. Ghost writing. Got nothing. And freezing temperatures. Only thing I had was freezing temperatures. I don't know. I don't even know why I continue to play this game. I'm just going to be flat out wrong every time. Like I said, it's it's better when you play this with more people, though, because more than one thing can go on at the same time. And that's kind of what I'm looking forward to. But, you know, that was fun. That was fun. Um, I'm still having fun with it, believe it or not. It's just... <sighs> when you win, it makes you want to play more. But when you keep screwing up. It's, I'm learning more and more about this. Uh, I don't know. Uh, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you had fun, even though it's, what, it's like three in a row we didn't get, uh, we didn't even see a ghost. But, uh, we heard a ghost singing in this episode. That was interesting. Um, so, definitely was, definitely had the creeps. Definitely had the creeps. So, uh, see you in the next one. Till next time. Bye.